hamburgers made from scratch. The most important thing about the video is I'm going to show you which kind of toppings you might want to consider for your burger. Here's a hint, no more than four. Preferable two, but I'm going to show you the five best toppings to use. And please don't use ketchup. Ketchup is its essence, corn syrup with sugar and a little bit of tomato. So go nowhere, let's create. A friend of mine gave me this ground beef from a cow he bought. See how pretty? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to transfer here. I'm going to grab a couple of eggs. And I only want the yolk. I don't want the white stuff. Let's make it two. And then I'm going to start mixing up everything together. Get up. Just mix it well. I'm going to put a little bit of sea salt. Some ground pepper. Mix it up, mix it up. Grab a ball. And, you know, with some finesse, still like creating a ball. It doesn't have to be perfect. You know, you start creating a, your party. Roll it a little bit. Roll it a little bit. I'm not pushing it hard. You know, it's, we did look at this with an ease. See? It's not going to look pretty and perfect because that's not the kind of person I am. But you're going to do your thing. So I have a long skillet. Um, both um, coils are hot, high heat. Put some uh, oil, go an extra virgin with my Australian uh, extra virgin olive oil because of the flavors, but you can use anything. Heck, you can use water if you want to. You can have your first burger. You can have your second. You can have your third. And you don't mess around with them, you just leave them there cooking. You know, don't mess with them, don't move them around, don't do anything yet. If you want to, you have a little bit of salt. Some more black pepper.
Let it cook for a little bit. There's only five type of toppings you should be eating your hamburger with. And should be no more than four toppings. Meaning of the five, you only pick four, no more than that. Sometimes I only pick two. So it should be onions, mushrooms, sweet peppers, tomatoes, and lettuce. That's it. And now those five toppings, once again, you pick no more than four, preferable two. This is about the meat, not about the topping. What I'm going to do, I'm going to put some mushrooms here. I don't want them raw, so I'm going to put them here. Onions, they're a little bit thick. Pepper, the sweet pepper. I like to put them with the juice. And let it cook for a little bit. I don't want to wash the burger, I don't want them burn the side. Not going to take long. A little bit. You want a little bit, um, you know, kind of, it looks like burn, but a little bit. Um, cook on the outside so the burger doesn't break. You're creating that base on the back and front. So see, but look how it's looking. You see? You see? This is not going to take a long time. Now, one thing I don't understand. <laughs> you have people eating burgers, but they're like vegetable burgers or some non-meat burger. It just doesn't make sense to me. Something that tastes like meat, but it's not meat. Unless you have a dietary deficiency, which I can see, I don't understand. If you don't like meat, why do you eat something that tastes like meat? I mean, you can eat whatever you want. See how, nice, how pretty it's looking? I flip it, you know? Just to show you. It looks like this in one side, but when you flip it, see how it looks? This is about ready. See? You're playing with the heat transfer here. You need to know your stuff, you need to know your equipment. And what I'm going to do, because I don't want this side to be like the other one, I want a little bit of juice. You know, coming that juice is when you buy it, you see that juice flowing. See? Let me put it that side for one more minute. One more minute. And now I said that don't move them around too much. But I have to just to show you. I have to move them just to show you what I mean. But technically, don't move them around too much. See how they look, how nice, see this side. The burning look is just an illusion. They are not burned, trust me.
Let me saute this a little bit longer. Not long, but not too long, about another minute. See? This in my hand, working with the other. Just big thing. Just big thing. I like to roast my burger bread. What I do is uh, put the heat as high and then put the bread there for a few seconds. Let's start putting this baby together. Bread slightly toasted. Now, I have five toppings, which is typically the only toppings I will eat in my burger. But rule of thumb for me, don't eat more than four toppings. In fact, traditionally, I only go with lettuce and tomatoes and that's it. But because I want to illustrate some things, I'm going to use four. And I think we're going to go with mushrooms. Some onions. Why not, right? Let's do some lettuce tomato this one has a happy smile let me pick a burger i think i have four right yep all right and here you have it 